Mr Dodds. Speaker, we cannot uh, forget the victims in all of this, the Dowler family, the McCann family and Christopher Jeffries and those who have suffered terribly, the innocent victims. We absolutely support the absolute freedom of the press. There can be no statutory regulation of the press, but there does need to be proper redress for those that are wronged. The Prime Minister says that he does not agree or wants to think again about Levison's recommendations on statutory legislation. He talks about alternative options. Can he give us a flavour of what those options might be? Um, because there, can, there is a feeling, I think, among some that this may be more to do with party management than really coming to deal with the problems in this. Uh, there is a variety of opinions right across this House, and I think we have to be frank about this. Uh, I think it is important to consider, as I say, a very, very big step of effectively passing statute about the press in this country. There are many independent, non-statutory bodies in this country of very long standing. The real test is not whether this body is backed by statute or not. The real test is, can it fine newspapers? Can it call editors to account? Can it get front-page apologies? That's what people want to know, and that's what we need to deliver. Mr. 